What's up, everybody? Welcome to the car edition of Don't Wait. I hope you guys are doing well. It's Monday, October 26th. Had to think through that. Uh, Weigh-in day was today. Pretty excited about that. Let's talk about something else real quick, though. I hear a lot of people, as we're talking through the journey and what's going on and what we're talking, like, what we're all going through weight loss-wise, I hear a lot of people say, well... I only have 20 or 30 pounds to lose, so it's not that urgent, or I'll get around to it. I get it. And listen, I understand that nothing that I can say in these videos or anything that I can say to your face will change what you're going to do, right? I know that. I know that for a fact. You're the only one that can make that decision. However, I want to tell you that even 20 to 30 to 45 pounds, again, preaching to the choir because this guy still 200 uh 200 something pounds overweight still got to lose some some more a lot more so but I, i'm creating urgency if you have 20 to 30 to 45 or 50 pounds to lose lose it create some urgency i'm telling you right now you will never get to where you want to be if you just say well i only have this amount to lose or i only have that amount to lose you're in a different space than I am. I get it. So I can't really talk to that space yet. But the reality is you got to make it happen. So stop making excuses. Lose those 20 pounds. I promise you, I guarantee you that you will feel 100% better. And if you put your mind to it, you could probably lose them in three to six months. Maybe less. I don't know. Something to think about. All right. So weigh in day to day. Uh, one pound lost, one pound loss for a total of 145 pounds and right at five months. Uh, Sunday, November 1st will be five months total. So 145 pounds. I'm not going to lie to you folks. I was a little disappointed this morning when I got on the scale. But uh, as you, most of you know, I've switched to doing paleo and also CrossFit. So the big thing in paleo is look, don't the scale is not the the indicator of success, right? I'm building so much muscle. I'm feeding my body with a lot of protein, a lot of vegetables. The muscle's growing fast. So bottom line is this, one pound is a win. I feel great um, and I'm excited about that. But again, it is a little disappointing and I'm a little paranoid, right? Because I see a few years, like weeks ago when I started paleo, I lost I went from the 11 pounds the week before down to 7 pounds, down to 5 pounds, down to 3 pounds, and now this week 1 pound. So a little nervous about that, but I'm going to keep going. Got some great advice from some, from some friends to say, listen, keep going, keep doing what you're doing. You're doing it right. So we'll see what happens. I want you guys to understand that I'm grateful for you. I love you so much. Uh, if you're If you're into the prayer thing, pray for me that I will be able to continue to do this. Also pray that I will be able to be more consistent with my videos. Um, and we'll even try doing them in the car, see if that works for you. If not, we'll figure something else out. But so grateful for you guys, I love you. If you've watched this video this far, would you do me a favor and would you share it on your Facebook wall? I feel like I'm kind of losing a sense of engagement with you guys. Maybe that's not true. Uh, if it is not, uh, good. If it is, please tell me. Like, Tell me what I can do to engage with you more. I, you know, we're not having as many people show up to the walks, um, which I don't know if it's just because it's colder or what, uh, but we're just we're not having as many people share the videos. And this is not a guilt trip, folks. I just want to know, right? Like, what is what has changed? Has anything changed on your side? Uh, or is it because I'm not posting videos as frequently? Let's have that conversation, okay? So grateful for you. Love you so much. We will see you soon. Mwah!